Good morning, everybody. I just got up a little bit ago. It's a beautiful morning. The sun's been up for a little while. Well, it's getting close to 8 a.m., so it's a beautiful morning. The air is clear and fresh, and my patio and all the flowers makes me happy. So I just thought I'd share this moment with my friends. I'm going to do a brief shamanic healing and work on some manifesting and abundance. And I just thought I would share it with you in case anybody wants to sit down with it later. Yeah, you can hear I'm out in my neighborhood. People talking, horns honking. <laughs> so um, first what we'll do is we'll do a little self-hypnosis. You know, the self-hypnosis we're all accustomed to where we just get relaxed. And my shamanic journey team are waiting. I have a elder shaman, ancient, ancient shaman, that has come to work with the shamanic journeys. And I have some from Australia, the Aborigines, and some from New Guinea. And the raven is my spirit animal. And I'm told that the wolf is with me. So let's get started. Our meditation, shamanic journey, for 888 Lionsgate. Settle into your comfortable place where you can stay for a little while. And let's start by doing some relaxation techniques. A stretch, take a nice big stretch, relax and settle down in your chair. Let your feet be strongly grounded onto the earth or the floor. A shaft of light comes down from above and swirls all around me and stabs into the bedrock beneath me and grounds me like a mountain. And my heart space expands like a giant sphere all around me filled with love, and I slip into a deep and strong connection with you. Dear ones of love and light and guides and angels, ascended masters, all those on the other side that wish to be with us, as my guardian angel has my back and I sit in my sacred space of protection, and Archangel Michael is my gatekeeper. Thank you, dear angels. We begin by taking some deep breaths, a deep exhale, and let your exhale be longer than the inhale. Again, a deep inhale, followed by a exhale that was longer than your inhale. Another deep breath. Another long exhale. Give yourself a hug and tighten up all over. Tighten up real strong. And release it and relax. And just sink into your chair or wherever you are. Let this beautiful, calming, warm energy Start moving down from the top of your head and everywhere it goes, it completely relaxes you. It starts moving down the back of your head, down the back of your neck. This warm relaxation moves down your face, closes your eyes. And goes down your chest down your shoulder blades and down your shoulders and this relaxation moves all the way down your arms to your fingertips and then it continues down your torso down your back and hips 
down your tummy. This relaxation continues down your upper legs, through the knees, down the shins and calves, into the ankles, and this relaxation goes all the way through to your toes. And you sink further down into your chair. And now you start to feel waves of relaxation. Feel the waves of relaxation that start at the top of your head. They go down your neck and down your back and down the backs of your legs, down to your feet and into the ground. And it comes back in another wave, slowly. And as it does so, you become even more relaxed. It is a comfortable, peaceful feeling. And now imagine with me that we are standing at the top of ancient stairs that go down to our meeting place in Mother Gaia. And with each step, we sink down deeper and deeper, starting with 10, 9, 8, 7, lower and deeper, 6, Five, four, sink down deeper, three, two, one. And now we stand before an ancient door and we see sparkles of light coming out of the cracks in the ancient door. And we can't wait to see what's there. As we open it, the raven comes and joins us and enters first. And we see that there's a comfortable, beautiful clearing in Mother Gaia waiting for us. It's twilight. It's not too dark. It's not too bright. And there's a campfire nearby, sparkling. Our dear guides and angels, we ask that all of you would join us here now at this time. As we celebrate and recognize the Lion's Gate portal at this time. We wish to observe this opening of this beautiful portal and manifest everything it is that we want to come into our life and also to receive healing for our physicalness. The angels and guides make a circle all around us, not too close, a little bit back. And they are just so pleased and happy that we're here. And there are indigenous ones playing drums. The Aborigines are playing their didgeridoos. And the New Guinea ones are doing their ceremonial dances. And it is a beautiful sight to see. We feel like we've come home as we take our seat of honor near the campfire. And our guardian angel stands up tall behind us. And we send the angel love and gratitude. The 
The elder one, the ancient shaman, who's in charge of this ceremony, steps forward and he smudges us. And he goes all around us with the smoke, clearing all negativity. Let all the negativity be cleared. Let it just drain through your body and drop to the earth. And the earth absorbs it and it is gone. And then the beautiful indigenous medicine woman steps forward and she has a cup of warm tea and she gives us a wink and she says drink this drink this dear one it's good for you and we do so and when we take a sip of it it's perfect and delicious and we love it and our body loves it and our body just absorbs it immediately and sends it bursting through our bloodstream and we feel it it's blessings our bloodstream is filled with blessings and it circulates through us into the heart and our heart is filled with blessings. And it settles there and it stays in a special place. An angel steps forward with a beautiful bowl with beautiful sparkling water that only angels have. And it's placed in front of us and we place our feet in the bowl of beautiful sparkling water. And as we do so, the angel passes her hand down from the top of our head over our body down our abdomen, down our legs, down to our feet, and waves it away. And all this negativity that was in us, anything that is there does not belong there, just flows down and out into that water. And another wave comes as the angel directs it with her hands washes down from our head down to our toes negativity into that special water any fear release it say i release it now i release everything that does not belong to me i release my fear I, I allow love and light to come in. And the angel removes that water and gives it back to the earth. And Mother Gaia knows how to handle it. And we stretch a little bit and it feels so good. Because we know we have been cleansed. A little indigenous child brings a towel and pats our feet dry. And an angel comes and puts special slippers on our feet. And these slippers are infused with a healing. We can't see it, but we can feel it. When we put our feet in the slippers, this healing starts coming up through our feet 
to our knees. This wave of healing comes up our torso, up our arms, up our back, to our neck, to the top of our head. It feels so good. An Archangel Raphael appears and holds his hands over us and shines the green light of healing directly onto our body. It enters our crown chakra and it goes back down the body. We open our arms and we say, I welcome my healing. I welcome my healing. Take some deep breaths here. And then relax. And some more angels come forward. And they ask us to stand up and we do so. And a trio of angels start smoothing down our energy body and our aura. They smooth it and smooth it with their beautiful angel hands, their beautiful angel energy. And we are soothed, we are at peace, we're so comfortable. Thank you, angels. And a beautiful blue light appears in front of us. It's about the size of an orange. And it speaks to us and it asks, what would you like to manifest into your life? Dear beloved one, and at this time, we speak out loud each thing that it is that we want to manifest in our life. Give all these things to the blue light. List each one out loud. Thank you, thank you, dear one. And the blue ball has become much bigger now. It's full of all of our hopes and dreams and wishes. And it's grown very large. And we put our hands under it and we lift it up towards the sky. And it's very light, it's light as a feather. And as we blow on it, it dissipates. And all the words we put into it come falling out and shower down on us. And we take them in. And Master Yeshua comes up to us and he places his hand over our head and he smiles. He's so happy.
and he reminds us, you are worthy. You are so worthy. You are loved. With a wonderful, unconditional love. You are worthy of receiving all that there is that you wish for. And he steps back. And now the group that has gathered around us Love and light angels and guides start swaying to the music, the drum beats, and they start a beautiful humming, a beautiful low humming. And the ancient shaman comes and dances in a circle around us. And then he comes up to us. And he pulls out some special herbs from the pouch he has. And he tosses them on us. And we see when they land on us that they are sparkling. And this sparkling will continue all day. During the day, we might look down at our body and see sparkling happen. It's more blessings. He just showered us with more blessings. Your guardian angel stands up tall over you again. And he says, remember, you are always surrounded by angels. Ask us, ask us for help. Tell us what it is that you want. We want to be part of your life and assist in any way that we are allowed to. Just ask. And we bow in gratitude and thankfulness to the dear angels. And a beautiful indigenous young princess brings a fluffy white cape and we see that it is lined on the inside with rainbow colors, crystals, crystalline energy. And she brings it to us and presents it to us and we put it over our shoulders and pull it closed in the front and it hugs us. Beautiful crystalline energy hugging us. And whenever we choose, we can go back to this time and accept that beautiful cape full of crystalline energy again and wrap ourselves up in it again. It feels so good. We're going to take this with us today and keep it. It's ours. Some beautiful horses come in and 
walk around, trot around our circle. And some of the indigenous ones get on them and they ride out the opening from the back where all of them came from. And the raven appears above us again and goes in circles above us. Signifying to the group that we are complete. As our guides and angels, and the people, entities, loved ones, whoever of love and light has been here with us, they depart. The dear elder shaman sits down by the campfire and closes his eyes and brings his hands to his heart. And the campfire starts to dim. And the light is getting brighter. And now we start wiggling our toes and we start wiggling our fingers. We stretch. When we are ready, we'll open our eyes. Archangel Michael has closed the ceremony and made sure that all is well and safe. Anything that might have been opened was closed. And we start to wake up. Take some deep breaths and have a beautiful day.